This is the Sin River as it sets a record for its highest level since 1982. Relentless rain over the past few days has caused the river to dramatically rise. Well, yes, it, it, I'm in awe because it, it is too high. Uh, and if it keeps on raining, it, that it will definitely overflow. And that's the fear. But French officials say they are confident the river reached its maximum height Friday afternoon local time and will now subside. With the sand six meters above its normal level, the famous footpaths that line the river are now completely flooded out. And when it comes to the trees along the riverbanks, well, you can't even see their trunks anymore. And you also can't see the famous art inside the city's iconic Louvre Museum. It was closed on Friday as a precaution, so museum staffers could move priceless works of art from lower levels to upper levels. Tourists who didn't hear the news found out from signs saying the museum made the choice to shut its doors. I was really excited to go in, see the Mona Lisa, see a bunch of the other artwork that they had there. So yeah, it was really disappointing that we couldn't get a chance to get inside. The southern suburbs outside of Paris have been hit the hardest. With flood water seeping into homes and apartments, thousands were forced to evacuate. Some had to be rescued. You have to have seen it and honestly lived through it. This is the first time I've been through this. We think it only happens to others, and then when it hits us, it's different. French President Francois Hollande is expected to declare a state of emergency in parts of the country. That's so these waterlogged neighborhoods can receive federal funds to pay for what will be a massive cleanup. Kevin Ozebeck, CCTV, Paris. If you like what you just saw, follow us on social media and visit our website, cctv-america.com.